Other interesting culture news, you have Jurassic World Kid Show having a lesbian kiss sparking outrage because, of course, that's a thing. Now, this is brought to us thanks to Libs of TikTok, and it's actually a commentary of a commentary, and this gentleman's voice is, i say, pretty good, pretty much better than mine. And she says before the clip, isn't Jurassic World just supposed to be teaching children about dinosaurs? Unquote. Which, that's how all education used to be. It used to be teaching kids about, you know, facts, history, math, science. Further reminder that public school is at 32 year low ACT scores and pretty much every other subject as well individually. And yet the teachers unions want more money. Perhaps they should focus more on actual, you know, history, education, mathematics, science, the zeros and ones, so to say, instead of teaching political identity and identity politics and sexual orientation. Yeah, yeah, and reason number 9,958,453 to homeschool your children. But nevertheless, this is, of course, in most major media. And again, there are millions of people who think this is a fantastic thing to introduce some to, the, to, to kids to these themes at a young age. I would say about half the country, well, maybe 20% don't care, maybe another 30% of them is against this. Without too much further ado, let me go ahead and span this. It's about a minute long. And it's, uh, let's see, this is going to be funny. It's like a, picture, a video of a video of a video. But let's see how it is. Folks, you need to check this out. We just sent our kids to bed. This Jurassic World was still playing, and we came across this. You were trying to tell me something before. What? Earlier, in the lift, before the Noctosaurus went all crazy, it seems super... I don't, I don't want to say she's dressed like a hoe. I wouldn't be that provocative. I wouldn't use that type of language, of course. Well, you have a kid show where the, one of the main gals is wearing, what is it, a tank top? Showing, exposing her whole arm. Which, in the Muslim community, I'm pretty sure she'd be in a lot of trouble. It was interesting what parts of quote unquote PC culture these cartoons chose to embrace, but I partially digress. Lord have mercy. Like, hard. Real hard. Jurassic World, you know. Jurassic World. Since when did this happen in Jurassic World? I thought it was about dinosaurs. Dinosaurs, guys. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Look at this. Jurassic World, guys. Protect the kids. Protect your kids. Yeah. Sometimes you have to watch what they watch. Wait, so now you have some perverts watching? So you have the two gals kissing, and then behind a rock is someone else staring at them. This is, I mean, what are they teaching here? So now they're teaching it's okay to spy on people? Is that voyeurism? Voyeur that's a whole other thing in and of itself. I, I checked the Urban Dictionary. That is the thing. Watch what they watch, guys. This is crazy, guys. This is Jurassic World, you know? Well, of course, everyone is a crowd. Has that ever happened? Like, even straight couples, like in the real world, is anyone ever clapping, giving accolades for someone kissing? I get it's, you know, it's a TV show, but in Hollywood does that in movies. But to me, that's also hilarious because that just, again, it's not realistic to talk about dinosaurs and all that stuff. But and I think in the show, maybe dinosaurs are still around, but in the unrealistic part. But nevertheless, has ever, is it, if that has happened, let me know. Unless it's like a famous person. Yeah, has anyone ever like given accolades and like everyone just applause just from kissing? But it's almost done, I swear. Partially digress. Jurassic World. And we sent our kids to bed just. They're finally official. I don't even think they changed their Facebook status. Which, <laughs> that might be pun because, you know, back in my day, that was like a big official thing. Like, once p two people start dating, they would change their Facebook status. And if they want to be an asshole or an a hole, apologize for that, they would just change their status from it's comp to it's complicated, which is just a way of women wanting extra attention. But, partially digress. Before this happened, we didn't even know this was going to happen. This is crazy. This is crazy, guys. Guys, watch what your kids are watching. So the girl says, and you says there's no perfect moment. So a perfect moment in this scenario is kissing someone and having all your friends watch, creepily watching but not telling you at first, then coming out and giving you all applause. Like, how's it not spell awkwardness? Be careful. No it's everywhere now. It is. Even in the Jurassic World. Which, I'm starting to see why people collect VHS tapes. Might not be a bad idea to dust off the veggie tails. One of those things where also, physical media can't be altered, so you know actually what you're getting. Whereas again, this, they could change this tomorrow. 
and we've seen many media companies change their material based on where they are releasing them geographically. Most famous, you had Disney having Lightyear with the gay kiss. And interesting enough, they removed it for Saudi Arabia, which to me shows that they're not authentically behind that type of ideology in some ways. They just want they just want to basically get whatever they can for money, which again, I understand that. Now let's get what pretty well I got 1.5 million views and 16,000 likes, which is quite a few to say the least. One of the first comments coming from Mr. Biggleworth Memes, which a plus for marketing, they did respond in meme form, which, you know, sometimes they do or do not. And he says, parenting in today's world, and his parents holding up a umbrella over their kids, and it looks like it's raining a rainbow. And some parents have a boy girl, it says, so there won't be, it says, I'll teach my own children, so there won't be any confusion. At 925 likes. Let's see here. John Hawkins says, the first duty of Hollywood and entertainment in general used to be to entertain and maybe throw in a healthy moral message. Now it's to promote weird, woke ideologies and convince your kids to be gay. Game 110 likes. What is that? You have the funny NFL meme. What is that douchebag? Uh, Tyler Kel... Oh, what is it? Is it Taylor or Tyler Kelsey? Taylor Kelsey. The guy with two girls... The, the, the football player has two girl names and is dating Taylor Swift. And it says accurate, and it's him yelling at the coach, and he's got the LGBT propaganda helmet, and the tro coach is just... It's being labeled me trying to just live my life. Game 410 likes. Livercat Media TM says, keep telling your kids and your youth, no one has to go along with this weird shit. 184 likes. Aku Sharma says, you can't beat the groomer ac acquisitions. And says, you can tell a Democrat they can't have sexual con Oh, when you tell a Democrat they can't have sexual conversations with a four-year-old, it's a fist getting all clenched. I got 704 likes, which is kind of creepy. All these adults want to have these type of conversation and themes with children, uh, especially that aren't even theirs. It's one thing if you're an adult, you want to talk about your kids with the birds and the bees? That makes sense. But if, yeah, just wanting to show random kids this and all that, kind of a red flag. Arthur Eagleman says, why do they ruin everything? Getting 649 likes. Wait, Triet Appointment says, tired of liberal woke agenda hurting children. Says, tired, raise your hand if you're tired of this shit. 355 likes. Dave the Mean Smith says, not surprising at all. It's Mr. Krabs from SpongeBob. SpongeBob. And... He said, it's like being interviewed by a reporter and it's a pride flag on the store. It says, what inspired you to change your corporate logo to rainbow flag? <laughs> wow. And Mr. Krabs simply responded with Satan. Got 534 likes. Which, I'm actually surprised he didn't say money because that's a whole show. And that's a shtick. But I understand that point as well. Let's see here. Thomas Regmington says, Jurassic World should be about dinosaurs eating, eating women, not women eating women. A little crass, but I'll, I appreciate it. Getting 277 likes. David Meansmith also says, and this is how it is. And it's Mickey Mouse with a switchblade. And it's got a transplanted pie pack. And it's a person being attacked. It says, kids trying to watch a movie about puppies. Getting 230 likes. If there's any contrarian statements. Founding Father Knows Best says, this is gross. I wish they would leave gay stuff out of kids' television. And is Dr. Evil saying this is indoctrination? Getting 60 likes. Which. Uh, Planet of Memes says it's not even June yet. Oh, come on, Planet of Memes. Didn't respond to meme form or meme form if you want to be fancy. That did get 92 likes, though, despite the fact that it was not a meme. Here, is this a contrarian statement? Uh, not really, just a random post. Let's see here. Yeah, interesting enough. Not seeing any contrarian statements at all. Pretty much everyone agreeing, you know, keep your kids off these devices. I mean, I won't say there's nothing good produced in the past 20 years, but you wouldn't be missing much if you just watched things back, you know, from back earlier in time. Truth be told, probably the best movies are all in black and white. Best acting, you actually had good, even better music, better morals, values, and you, had, you didn't all have to have a message crammed down your throat. So yeah, needless to say, physical media is exceedingly important because one, it can't, it's yours, you own it. Two, it can't be censored. And three, you're not injecting themes that you have no idea. And also reason 9,958,453,723 to view all materials before letting your children see them, whether it be a book, or movie, film, song. It's one of those things where I didn't understand as a child, but the older I get, the more I realize, oh yeah, 110%. If you're a parent, I want to say that's your number one priority, but that is one of the I think one of the top priorities is helping filter the materials to ensure 
your kid gets to the appropriate materials at the appropriate time and grows up to be a well-rounded individual. But let me know in the comments. Again, there are millions of people who, again, this will probably sell some subscriptions to whatever that Jurassic Park World Kid cartoon is. Because again, there are millions of people who do think it's a good idea to introduce these types of messages to kids as young as possible. Very unusual, and those people are usually arrested later in life for different things. I shall not speak of, but just total coincidence. But again, there are, I have some friends who, I have some friends of that community, or not that community, friends who are in the gay community who think it is a good thing to have them. They usually talk about like introducing you know, like movies, like when they're maybe a teen or something like that, where like you have a gay couple in the movie, or like, what was it? I think Friends had a gay couple, didn't they, in the 90s, something like that. But yeah, in cartoons, that's for. That's where I think most of the debate really starts to happen. It's one of those things where, again, once you're an adult, watch whatever you want. Like, it's not a controversy, not a cultural discussion, really, that I think of when it comes to, like, a, a movie that you and I see at theaters rated PG-13 or R when they have a gay character or a gay couple. That, in the United States, it really isn't that much controversial anymore. It, it gets annoying if, you know, if that's, like, the one theme of the show. It's just overbearing, like anything, if the theme is just too much and takes you away from the main theme of the film or main theme of the cartoon. But let me know in the comments. As always, I'd be fascinated to hear what you have to say. Thank you, everyone, for taking the time to tune in. Again, trying to get to 4,000 subscribers by the end of the month. So if you could click that button, I'd greatly appreciate it. Also, leave a thumbs up, thumbs down, or comment. is a great way to give me some additional feedback, letting me know how I can make the show better and better. Lastly, don't get to take time to tell your family, tell your friends, tell your coworkers, tell your enemies, anyone and everyone. Just stay safe, fight the good fight.